How's it going guys, Tactics HD here with an HL15 video, and this video guys is looking at the top 5 right wingers on HL15. Starting off the list guys, at number 5 we have Martin Stanley, 88 overall player. Uh, Martin Stanley, obviously very good player, got traded uh, to the New York Rangers last year, still continued to have a really good season, uh, you know, making it to Stanley Cup final. Like I said he's lost a little bit of speed, so he's not quite as fast as he used to be, but he still has uh, very good puck skills and senses, coming in at 5 stars in both categories. As well guys, he has a uh, 90 rating in both passing and puck control, so his playmaking ability is still very high. Next guys, at number 4 we have Patrick Kane, coming in at 89 overall. I really expected Kane to be higher than this. I thought he'd be 90 overall at least. Uh, I probably pegged Kane to be somewhere between 92 and 94 overall. Uh, he's just so good offensively, you know, one of the best offensive players in the game. But uh, they said, you know, he does have very good offensive skills. Uh, he has five star puck skills, shooting, skating, and senses. Uh, his puck skills are 94 passing and 95 puck control with uh, 96 hand eye and deking. Uh, the only thing lacking in his game is his physicality. Obviously, not you're not someone to big, uh, throw out the big hits or anything like that. He only has two and a half star physicality. So I guess uh, that that stat right there, you know, really brought his overall down. Otherwise, it'd be uh, in the 90s for sure. But Kane, obviously, still a very good offensive player. Uh, he's just someone that's probably not going to be the best to uh, send into the corners as he'll probably get beat up. Next, guys, at number three, of Phil Kessel coming at 90 overall. Kessel, obviously, one of the best snipers in the game. Uh, he's got very good shooting stats. Uh, he actually has 93 wrist shot accuracy and 90 wrist shot power. So Kessel's probably uh, arguably one of the best snipers in regards to the right wings. He might not be the highest overall, but I think he might have the best shooting stats of all right wingers. Actually, sorry, second uh, shooting stats behind Kane. Kane definitely has the best offensive stats of any right winger. Next, guys, at number two, we have Marion Hossa coming at 91 overall. Marion is just a very good all-around right winger. Uh, he has uh, the best all-around right wing stats in the game. They said with five-star puck skills, senses, skating, and defense. So, Hosa is just a very good all-around player, and that's why he gets that 91 overall rating. And finally, guys, at number one on the list, we have Corey Perry coming in at 92 overall. Obviously, Corey Perry, just like Hosa, a very good all-around player. He does it all. Uh, he can score goals. He can you know, lay out hits. He plays defense. And uh, Perry has five-star physical abilities that give him an edge over everybody else. He's the only one with five-star physicality. As well, you know, he's a very good offensive and defensive player. So, Basically, Perry is just the best all-around right winger, and you know, having uh, good stats in every single category, opposed to you know, a couple amazing, couple uh, lackluster, really just gave Perry the edge and uh, gave him number one spot on this list. So anyway, guys, that's it for the top five right wingers. Let me go. What you, let me know what you guys think of these players, as well as uh, you know, the overalls that they were given. Besides that, guys, stay tuned tomorrow. Uh, we'll have the top five centers. And besides that, guys, thank you for watching. If you enjoyed the video, please give a like. Uh, stay tuned more, guys. Have a nice day. Goodbye. It's the kind of beat the goat.